Hey there guys, 115Rex back here again. T today I'm doing another Star Wars Saga Legends figure review. And today I have the Stormtrooper. So here he is. Very cool figure. He was like $7.99 at my Toys R Us. Got him with the Death Star Trooper. So it was like the day I found Imperial Troopers. But anyways, um, his packaging, 2010-2011. Got the Saga Legends logo. I don't know why they put blue blast on his E3 blaster because it's supposed to be red. But, um, nevertheless, it's a pretty cool picture. Um, he's number 25. Here's a picture of them in A New Hope. Here he is. He is a repackage of the 2004 Trilogy Collection Stormtrooper. Here's the paragraph. Um, the rest of the wave, Darth Vader, Sith Apprentice, Yoda, R2-D2, Darth Vader. Um, paragraph says, Stormtroopers are the military enforcers of the Emperor's will. They strike with speed and accuracy to quell any uprising against the Empire. From Coruscant to the Outer Rim, they keep order with an iron fist. Serving as ground forces in a space-based Imperial fleet. So now on to the figure. He comes with the Adventures Code. I'm not going to give those out because I might use them. A Galactic Battle Game card with instructions on the back. A dice. Or a die. A uh, stand. Generic Star Wars logo. Bubble wrap, not really accessory, just I don't know. Um, but the only accessory he really comes with is his blaster, no paint on it, just straight up black, cheap plastic, really rubbery. Knowing Hasbro, they're really getting cheap on us with the Saga Legends. Um, comes with the holster, you could put it in, but again, it's like really hard to get in there, and yeah, I just give up right away. Um, Helmet is the same, no new paint, no anything. Same old, just nice and white and fresh. A little bit of a shinier plastic on there. Armor pads, shoulder pads. Um, but he's got a ball jointed head, ball jointed waist, ball jointed shoulders, ball hinge elbows, swivel wrists, uh, ball jointed knees, and ball jointed ankles. Um, I think they made his back to tank fatter than usual, I don't know. Maybe just me, but every time you try and hold this blaster, it, like, bends. But, um, it's pretty good. I, I would army build on this, but the Vintage Collection Stormtrooper is far better, so I recommend that trooper better than this one. But, you know, if you see him and you can't find anyone else, then definitely get this guy. But, enough chatting. Um, hope you like the review, and hopefully soon I'll be having another video, because lately I haven't had much. So, see ya.